this is Aaron Mars, the U.S. Sales and Service Manager for PS Audio, and I want to go over a new feature between the AirLens and the DSD Mark II after they've been updated to the latest updates called S-Connect. This is a volume control for different control softwares like Rune, Spotify, Tidal, and other programs like that. So you can actually use the volume control and it works very stably this way. Okay, so first off, we need to make sure that we have both our DSD Mark II and our AirLens on the most current software. First off, I want to turn off both units. So turn them off from their switches. So this is a USB A to A cable, and it's a special cable that talks between the AirLens and the DirectStream DAC Mark II. They're available on psaudio.com whenever you purchase one of our USB sticks, or you can find them on Amazon or places like that. But they're a kind of special USB cable just because they both have the A to A ends. Okay, so I'm gonna turn the units around and show you where to plug these guys into. So now we have the back of both of our DSD Mark II and our air lens. So where you wanna plug this in is in the firmware slot in both the air lens and the DSD Mark II. So we'll plug one end in here and make sure that there's no USB plugged into either one of the units. Okay, we'll plug this guy in here. Here you go. So our A to A cable is now plugged in. I'm gonna go ahead and turn around the unit and we'll go from there. After turning around your unit, you wanna do this. You're gonna to wanna to turn your air lens on first. So air lens on. Give it a second to initialize. And then we're gonna turn our DSD Mark II on. Give that a second to load here. Now, if you have all your updates done and everything correct, you should see the S-Connect symbol. That means you are now available to use volume control in either Rune, Tidal, Spotify, any one of those that uses digital volume control. So if that little S is not showing up, little tip is to restart both units, turn the air lens on first, and then the DSD Mark II. Also, you just need to double check that both your units are on the latest software. Okay, once we have our S Connect ready and going on our DSD Mark II, See your little S right there? And everything's updated. We can go ahead and go into Rune or whichever software you want to do. So a couple things that you need to make sure is that fixed volume is turned off on your DirectStream DAC Mark II. Thing to do would be update your Rune core and then restart everything. So restart the Rune core, restart the DSD Mark II, and restart the Air Lens. So once you do that, you're going to pick your air lens in Rune, which is the bottom right hand corner, and it's whatever your air lens is called. And then next to it, you'll see a little volume icon. And whenever you move that slider up and down, as you can see, now I have volume control in Rune. Now a thing to note is if you go up too fast, like I just went from zero and I tried to go all the way to 100, the S-Connect will only go up in intervals of 20. That way we protect the speakers, we aren't trying to you know, blast anything out. So if you want, you just do nice smooth up and down and you have full volume control. So there you go. That's how you add the S-Connect feature onto the DSD Mark II and the AirLens. Thanks so much.